to pray is to change. Most of the time when I'm praying, I don't necessarily want God to change me. I want God to change my circumstance that makes me feel very uncomfortable. And God cares more about your character than your career. It is my hope that today you would make a decision before God and before your faith community. I will go to God in prayer in a different way today. Today I will approach the throne knowing that God is who he is. He's a good father and he will reward me for diligently seeking him. And I give him permission to do a work in my heart that will change and transform when you are changed, you become a change agent for others. As you are blessed, then you're a channel of blessing to other people. What would it look like if all of us had been so touched by the power of prayer that we become prayers, that his kingdom would come on earth as it is in heaven? That even as we're walking at the grocery store or walking neighborhoods, we're looking at houses and saying, God, this house represents at least one person, possibly a family. And I pray that your wholeness and your healing and a touch from Jesus would come to this home. God, I, I want these hands to be clean. I want this heart to be pure. So as I prepare to meet with you and sing this song, that this song may become a prayer. St. Augustine said to sing is to pray double and that we would ask God, God, give me this, this gift of clean hands and a pure heart and that I would come to you knowing that you're going to reward me. This is not just a song I sing at the end of service and then I go to lunch. This is a prayer I pray that can change me 